Hey everybody, it's Theo here, Pirate Troubadour, reporting for duty on World Oceans Day, which is the perfect day to wear this fabulous t-shirt, hashtag save the whales. And some of the ways you can save the whales shall follow, because I promised environmental tips, and I know that's not what you normally get from a music channel, or following a musician, but this is a something that's really I'm really passionate about, so... Here we go. Helena and I noticed the other day on our um, well-known washing up liquid brand, whose name shall not be named, um, on their bottle, just on the back, very clearly says, uh, will cause long-lasting damage to aquatic life. Will cause long-lasting damage to aquatic life, right? And that's that's a that's a that's a choice we can make. They put it on there. Do you want to... No, I don't want to cause long-lasting damage to aquatic life. And for that reason, we now buy... This is just an advert. I'm not being sponsored yet. For EcoCover. EcoCover. EcoCover? EcoCover. Ha discussions on how to pronounce it in comments, which is um, just basically much better for the ocean and stuff. Um, so that's one of my tips. Don't use the, the well-known brand just because you know who they are. Use a brand like this who is much more eco-friendly. My second tip is about plastic. You know when you get letters in the post and they've got a little plastic window for your address and then you feel fancy, but actually it's really just really... Those are always the boring letters, right? The ones that are fully paper, handwritten, those are the exciting ones. And this is a side note for sending more handwritten letters of love to your friends, family, uh, pets, adopted turtles, whatever. Do it. Anyway, back to uh, the case in hand, plastic. I wonder if many people think, ah, oh, there's plastic in it, so I just need to throw the whole thing away. You don't need to, because as you can see, what I do is rip out the plastic window, and then you can recycle all of the paper, because everywhere recycling paper at the moment, if you're not councils get with the program and co-op are now doing recycle your thin plastic so we collect that all up and take it down there and recycle it so nothing goes into the ocean which is obviously fabulous uh, there's i think there's other supermarkets that might do it as well um, just have a, a look around so um yeah saving the whales right next thing my song, Only the Whales Know Why, it's going to be part of the, the new album, the second album, which is currently in rec recording, production, uh, so it's it's a little way off, but it is, there is energy with it, and I am really proud and excited about it. So the Whales, Only the Whales Know Why is a song I wrote with Helena, actually. She is the other co-writer on this song, and it is about Where is Home? Why do we feel called to a certain place or a certain um, person? And I conclude that only the whales know why, because they are beautiful, majestic creatures and they, they have the answers. We just need to listen. We need to listen much better than we are to, to them and the turtles, which are also beautiful creatures and just all of natural life and Mother Earth, we need to listen and stop defacing. So I shall uh, give you a snippet of my song, Only the Whales Know Why. So kiss it as in ship for a ship to sail him through The ice of the Antarctic, cold and freezing still No borders, no men of war, just birds and a soaring will Two years in a wilderness of white and ice and blue Little well from his home, twas the whalers saved his crew. So listen, all ye wanderers, all you with restless souls. Go to where your heart is cold, and the cold will turn you whole. Where we 
we feel we're meant to be. A sailor in the land of ice, we would choose such hardship twice. It's aching hard, we're back to die. Let the whales know why.